visionary director, you know, you know, you can tell that the scope of the project is just going to be massive, which it was. Um, and it's also his humor is just so bizarre and funny. Like the more specific something is, sometimes I feel like the more funny it is. And his humor is like incredibly weird and specific. Harley is a catalyst of chaos. I always think of her that way. And I, I actually think it's better when she doesn't have to be your moral center or, or even your emotional center all the time because it just gives her more leeway to behave I think more authentically like her which is to be unpredictable a like you know morally ambiguous um, and and she operates so well with other people around her you know the beach run for example I think that was my first day of shooting and there's so many pyrotechnics set up and um, you know it would take them so long to kind of like rig it all and you knew things were like blowing up all around you like actual gunpowder is blowing up right next to you and you felt I felt like I was in a war zone I felt like it was it looked had the look very much of a 1970s you know Vietnam war film oh I find King Shark so cute as well and he's one of my favorite characters I remember when we did the first Suicide Squad with David I was like why is it King Shark in it he was, he was just I'd, I'd always been like Gosh, we can't have the Suicide Squad without King Shark. Um, so I was so happy when I read this script and saw that Kingy, King Shark was going to be joining the gang. Amanda Waller, I always think of as kind of like Jack Nicholson's character in A Few Good Men, where she's a bit of a necessary evil. You know, like the, you want me on that wall. You need me on that wall. She's kind of that. Like she's willing to do the things that people don't want to know about so they can sleep at night. I saw it on a big screen and it's, I mean, it, people are gonna freak out when they see this. It's so, if there was ever a movie to go to the cinema to see, it is this one, because it's, it's huge and insane, and it's fun and funny and weird, and the music's incredible, and it's really emotional, and everyone really has like, like, I think people genuinely cry in places and really laugh out loud in places 